while the lights are about to go down here in Lincoln, Nebraska, the Pershing Centre, where we saw a magnificent card that was Resurrection Fighting Alliance number 13. Hello everybody, Michael Chevello, Pat Militic with you. Pat, what a night we saw and it kicked off in fine style as Derek Minna tapped out Austin Lyons in our very first fight. Yeah, we looked forward to this fight being a great submission matchup. Both guys said they were great on the ground. Decent striking out of both of them, but uh, Miner showing that he could get it done on the ground. Derek Minna took his record to eight and three. Austin Lyons fell 10 and three. Great transitions by Miner. Chidi and Jaquani and Chris Heavily was turning into a fantastic affair, and then we saw this elbow. A fully chambered downward elbow to the spine of Heavily that laid him out for some 10 minutes, Pat. He had to be stretched out of the cage. Yeah, they're pretty sure that Heavily has broken ribs, refused to go to the hospital, though. Tough guy. He was looking great in that fight, and uh, unfortunate that that happened. Our co main event. Beast mode, Miles Marshall and Andrew Sanchez. Sanchez had Marshall's number, and indeed Sanchez beasted Beast mode. Yeah, Miles Marshall wanted to stand up in this fight. Sanchez wanted no part of that. Get this fight to the ground, go to work, and finish Marshall. And in the main event, Dakota Cochran came in as the underdog against Efren Escudero. But it was Dakota Cochran who survived submission attempt after submission attempt, worked his ground and powered, was magnificent and took a unanimous decision. Cochran was a tornado for the first two rounds, but that third round, I tell you what, he battled out of a very, very tight spot. Pat, a night full of highlights here tonight, but for us, certainly it was that main event. It was our fight of the night, Dakota Cochran upsetting Efren Escudero, and my word, the predicaments that Dakota got himself out of, and then to fire back, it was amazing. And on top of that, Escudero showing that he truly wanted that fight, wanted to go back to the UFC, and got after it in that third round. Folks, plenty more action coming your way in your home for Mixed Martial Arts Access TV. Next up, we're in Tulsa, Oklahoma. March 21, join us for Legacy Fighting Championship number 29.